Hi everyone, in today's quick tip video I'm just going to show you how you can locate your properties and object pane in Embrilliance Essentials. This is the one question I see asked in groups on the internet several times a week. So I've opened up my Embrilliance and I'm just on my 4x4 hoop and I'm going to click on the A at the top of the screen which is the create a lettering design and that automatically brings on the ABC and as you can see over here I've got no objects pane and I've got no properties pane so I've got no way of being able to change this font or make this ABC into a word. And this is something, like I say, that I see asked over and over and over again. How do you get it back? It's really simple. You go up to the very top of your screen on your computer and you go to the view menu. Left click on the view menu and then come down to manage views. And you need to make sure that these two are ticked. I have all three. This third one, status bar, is basically this at the bottom. If I untick status bar, you'll see all the information about the hoop size or the size of the design that's in the hoop have disappeared. So you go view, manage views, put the status bar back on and then you go view, manage views and you make sure you tick these. So when you click object view, your objects pane comes back and when you click view manage views and go to properties view your properties box appears so now over on the right hand side in the properties where it says abc you can type your word and then from here under font you can choose you know the font that you want to choose and that is as simple as it is another quick tip a lot of people say my hoop isn't showing on my screen. If you click the H key on your keyboard, it will come back. So I've just clicked the H key to make it disappear. If I click the H, letter H on my keyboard again, it brings it back. So two very quick tips for you today. This is in Embrilliance Essentials. I hope you found that helpful. Please give the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.